What's going on guys, it's your boy the GCC and in today's video we're going to be taking a look at official images of the LEGO Star Wars March 1st set. If you guys enjoyed today's video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up. Now let's get into the actual video. Alright guys, so the first set that we're going to be looking at today is the Buildable R2-D2 set. Now this looks pretty interesting, of course this is going to retail for $100 and have that release date of March 1st, 2024, which is, you know, relatively soon honestly, so I'm kind of excited for this. Now I know we recently got like a UCS like Buildable R2-D2 I want to say like two or three years ago. So I'm surprised they're doing this $100 uh, version. But of course, in the set, you would get another R2-D2 minifigure, of course, which is pretty standard for the set. It also looks like you would get that 25th anniversary Darth Malak minifigure, which I think is really cool. We've never had Darth Malak before. So that's awesome. Of course, you can see he does have that 25th anniversary stand, which I think is pretty cool. And I just love this set. I love the box art and how they're kind of going with like that teal colorway and stuff like that. You can see Tatooine in the background in the Twin Suns, which I think is pretty cool. I think $100 is a very appropriate price for this set. I mean, this definitely isn't the most exciting set. This definitely isn't the most exciting set um, out of the other March 1st sets, which we'll be talking about in just a minute. But um, I definitely think it's interesting and it's a great way to pick up that Darth Malak minifigure. All right, guys, the other set that we'll be releasing on March 1st, 2024 is Boarding the Tantive 4. Of course, this has 502 pieces. This will retail for $55 and release on March 1st, 2024. I really love this set. I think this looks absolutely amazing. Of course, this is kind of like a hallway scene, similar to the Dark Trooper attack that we got back in 2022. So in this set, it looks like you get seven sides of minifigures which i think is absolutely awesome for that 55 dollar price range of course you would get that darth vader minifigure which we've had in previous other sets it also looks like you would get two stormtroopers which is always nice i just feel like we need more imperial stormtroopers it also looks like you would get that wedge antilles minifigure which is always nice to have in this tantive 4 set and it also looks like you would get two rebel troopers which again is really nice i know we recently got one in the yavin 4 base so to have two other ones in this boarding set which i think is really nice and of course the 25th anniversary minifigure is that arc trooper fives from the clone wars of course you know everyone has their complaints about this minifigure with like the helmet printing and stuff like that but i'm not going to be talking about the negatives of that minifigure in this video but of course he does have a brick built backpack which i think is awesome and super exciting which is definitely more accurate to what we saw in the clone wars and stuff like that but i definitely think this looks amazing i mean i just love how big and detailed this boarding scene is which i think is pretty cool i'm assuming you'd be able to get a couple of them maybe and maybe they'd be able to connect or something like that i just can't wait till we get more pictures and stuff like that but i definitely think this looks awesome if you guys are new to the channel or you enjoyed today's video go ahead hit that subscribe button i'd really appreciate it and again you would really help out the channel also go ahead give this video a thumbs up again i'd really appreciate it, it would help out the video big time i know i say that a lot guys but it really would mean a lot i know this video was kind of short today guys but i just wanted to get this news out to you as quick as possible so i really hope you guys enjoyed it and i'd really appreciate giving this video a thumbs up but again i really hope you guys enjoyed it, and i'll see you in the next one